say, Hallelujah, the Son of God is coming again. And the people say, Hallelujah, say, Hallelujah, oh, say, Hallelujah, say, Hallelujah, yeah, yeah, Hallelujah. And the people say, Alleluia, the Son of God is coming again. And the people say, Alleluia, the risen, Jesus Christ, the risen Lord is coming again. And the people say, Alleluia. Let me take that away again. Jesus Christ, the risen Lord, is coming again. And the people say, Alleluia. Say, Alleluia. Oh, say, yeah, Alleluia. Say, Alleluia. Oh, say, yeah. And the people say, Alleluia. The Son of God is coming again and the people say alleluia the son of god is coming again and the people say alleluia jesus oh say yeah alleluia alleluia yeah yeah alleluia and the people say, Alleluia. Jesus Christ, the risen Lord, is coming again. And the people say, Alleluia. Say, Alleluia. Say, say, Alleluia. Say, Alleluia. Oh, say, yeah, Alleluia. And the people say, Alleluia. Glory! <laughs> well, 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 welcome to the show. Are you folks, how was your weekend? Mm. Black Stars won their game today, didn't they? But who did they play? Nicaragua. Wow. And we beat them by a goal to nil. Well, they didn't feel the day I used, so I wasn't uh, particularly happy at the beginning. Uh, but that was a victory anyway. But those of you who saw the game between um, Portugal and Spain, what? What a game it was. Amazing. Cristiano Ronaldo, he never dies. That was a real good game. Good evening. Welcome to this edition of Good Evening Ghana. Tonight, we have a lot for you. Now, we started with the worship and... Okay, let's, let's, take, let's take one line of the worship again, you know, because the Son of God is coming again. And the people say, hallelujah. Controversial as always, uh, but it's useful and it's truthful. Okay, so I was thinking about National Cathedral and said, Charlie, folks, if we can build this National Cathedral, you see, and then we we'll take a day in the uh, year, you know, sorry, uh, <laughs> we we'll take a day in the year, and then we go to the National Cathedral, maybe on, on the 5th of March, you know, on the eve of independence, we go to the National Cathedral, and then everybody brings their sacrifice mm. to God, and then we send it to the altar of the National Cathedral, led by President, Vice President, Ministers of State, Council of State, members of Diplomatic Corps, the military, the police, and we design a military event. And then the trumpet plays the song. You know, there's a song they sing in Chi. Guan She Nung. Onama nejo baya nejo bai, kwan she fono, woma yesu trin kwan, yesu trin kwan. Ye zi ye na fori ba, e razi, ye ni si ka ne ji te, ye ni shi, ba ye de ye kumama o. Oh, Erade. Trumpeter, give me that one. Imagine it. Let me show you some photographs of Nasa Cathedral.
You see, if we were to do that as a nation, I'm sure that we'll get to the highs that many nations have gotten to. All the arguments are available, and people made arguments in 1236 or so when the British built Westminster Abbey, the cathedral, but they built it in honor of the Lord, and they went there to sacrifice for the Lord. And Apostle Paul told them back in the day when he was preaching, and uh, they were comparing the logic of his preaching to the values that they had learned from Aristotle and Plato and all that. And he told them that he had learned more than them. You see, Apostle Paul said, I've learned all the things that you have learned. And indeed, he was a mighty scholar. He was a stupendous scholar. And he said, all the things that you are talking about, which I, Apostle Paul, has learned, they do not compare to the knowledge of Christ. So the knowledge of Christ is not logic. It's not the common sense things that we go to learn in chemistry and biology. That's not how nations get turned around. Nations, if nations got turned around by chemistry and physics and, and sociology and economics, we will not be where we are. Why have we been making the same mistakes that we continue to make? There is a certain spirituality that an individual must connect to his background to be able to fix himself, a society, an individual, a company, everybody, and it includes a nation. So I'm looking forward to the day when we will set out a date in the calendar of the 12 months that this is a day for national sacrifice, to go to the National Cathedral and render our sacrifice, led by the military, fully dressed in military gear, the chief of defense staff will carry his sword with service commanders, and they march in slow motion into the cathedral, followed by the president and the vice, members of parliament, members of the council of state, and followed by all dignified and important people, and Ghanaians representing all walks of life, come into the cathedral on one night, the 5th of March, ushering in Independence Day. And we go to God and we say, Guan Shefono, Wonam Anajobaya Anajobai. Guan Shefono, Woma Yesu Trinqua, Yesu Trinqua. Yezi Yena Foriba, Erazi. Yenisi Kanijite. Yenishi, ye de ye kumama wo, erade, ye de ye kumama wo, erade. That's the day I'm looking forward to, and it's going to come. <laughs>